When I was first in, uh, in practice, uh, nurses could not give chemotherapy. Only physicians could give chemotherapy. I mean, it's incredible how far nursing has come in my lifetime. Dr. Susan McMillan has been at the University of South Florida College of Nursing for over 34 years. She has been a transformational leader. Throughout her 34 years, I really pleasantly have discovered the, the numerous nurses that she has mentored, that she has actually perhaps hooked into. You will come in and now be an oncology nurse. And at her recent retirement uh, celebration, I was really uh, heartfeltly taken aback by the, the impact that she's had on the uh, science and the profession of nursing within the realm of oncology and the care of the patient with cancer. As far as the college is concerned, uh, has highly contributed to moving research forward in the college. Uh, if, uh, if it wasn't for her, we wouldn't be NIH uh, designated as uh, number one. Her contributions to oncology are wide-reaching in this area. Um, we have many graduates locally that were educated under her and including myself and so the specialty of oncology around here, the physicians that work in oncology know that if they want an oncology trained NP that this is where to come and that is all because of her. When I first got into oncology people often would ask me, isn't it depressing working with cancer patients? And I said, no, it's exactly the opposite of depressing. Yes, of course, some people uh, die of their cancer. We're all gonna die of something. Uh, sometimes they die of cancer, but the reason I think I like it so much is that most of us who go into nursing do it because we wanna help people. We have got six tenured oncology nurse scientists in the College of Nursing at USF. That is phenomenal all of them actively working and doing research, seeking funding. Um, so I don't need to worry about that program leaving. So my legacy is that this program is here. It is known nationally and internationally. People come here from around the country because they know this is here and it's a good, strong program. The biggest part of my legacy is my graduates because they're out there doing it. it I feel like I threw a pebble in a pond and it, it's gone out in ripples and ripples and ripples. She's blessed and she's brilliant and I have been honored to know her not only as a professor, as a, as a leader in nursing science, but also as a dear colleague.